Ladies and gentlemen, this is a clinic that AWS is putting on the RHW right now. Ah. And he continuously goes to work on the arm, but he's going to have to break because he's against the ropes. One, two, three, four. Ah. Oh. You will hear that all the way back here in Georgia. Oh. What a move. One, two. That dude kicks out. That dude's going to grab the rope for good measure. And the Redeemer is going to come right back in here to finish up what Mike Cross has done for him. Oh! One, two, and that dude barely kicks out of that one. How's he kicking out? I don't know. I don't. <laughs> And continuous work on that arm. He must have like a red bullseye on that arm. I'll tell you what, these AWS people are pretty smart. They know where to go when there's a to exploit an injury. And dead dude's rolling him up. He's got him down. One. No, he's got the rope. And dead dude rolls back into a bad position where he does not need to be. Damien Zeddo was extremely smart by... Whoa! Oh, kicked his head! That dude gets up with all the strength he's got left. Putting him down. And he's dragging him. Make the tag to Camo Kid. And he's going to have to break. He's going to have to get out of the ring now. Oh, Mike Cross cheating over there. So both competitors are down now. 15 minutes. This is the show. And Camel Kid's smart. Just running him down with as much strength as he could to prevent him from tagging Mike Cross. Rolls him over, or throws him over. Gets him by the arm. Sadoc trying to reach for them ropes. He's very close, he's very close. Oh, he almost looked like he tapped out there, but he didn't. He's trying to reach. Now he's getting up instead. Picks him up, showing that strength that he has that Camo Kid doesn't have against him. Camo Kid has to quicken the pace on this one to take down the big monster, the Redeemer, Damien Zadok. Zadok trying to go for the tag on my cross. Not close enough. Not close enough. Camo Kid, if he's smart, let's get out of the way. My cross is in. Camo Kid ducks. Hits him with an elbow. Irish whip. God dang. What a vicious move by the suicide, Mike Cross. I think he knocked Camel Kid all the way into tomorrow. Now I'm dropping onto his chest. Getting him up. Punches to the head. More punches. Getting him up. Fireman's carry. Oh! I think that's the move CM Punk uses. GTS, if I'm correct. Good move, by the way. Oh! Oh, and Mike Cross misses on that one. 17 minutes. Oh, Mike. One, two. Mike Cross gets out of that one. What a beautiful move. By Camo Kid, and he's getting ready to strike again. He's just waiting, biding his time, getting ready for the right position. The Redeemer's going over there. And Camo Kid's smart enough to snip that one out. He's got eyes in the back of his head, too. And I don't know why he's trying to get in a shoving match with the Redeemer. <laughs> and he quickly tags in Dead Dude, saying, finish him off. But the bigger man win. But no, he's going to go against Mike Cross. Hit to the head. 
strikes. It's more like a boxing match than it is a wrestling match. God dang the fury of freaking Mike Cross, Irish Whip, gets him up. And how did it? Oh! I can't even finish the sentence without going, oh! oh! And Ted dude just can't get up. Mike Cross is using his speed and his agility to stop this guy from getting up, but Dead Dude continues to get up. God. Oh! Mike Cross is taking him to the woodshed. If there was one. Get him up. Somehow Dead Dude gets out of that one. I don't know how he's got the ropes. One, two. Dead Dude looks like he wants to put this one away, but I don't know. It looks like so many times when everyone could put this away, but it hasn't happened. Getting him up. Could this be? Could this be? No, it can't be. It's a slam. Scoop slam. He's going up high. Doing something he normally doesn't do. Oh! Attempts a frog splash, but he fails at doing that. Mike Cross has got to take advantage of this now. Mike Cross is stalking his prey. Oh! Super kick. Oh, he's taking down the the knee pad. Shades of Elijah Burke from ECW. And he puts it back up. Now, I'm not a California kid. I won't tell you this reminds me of any type of series or nothing like that. But this is a good match. My cross is going to go up again. Now he's going to look like Elijah Burke with this one. His hero... You're barely holding on. Gets him one, two, kicks out. Barely. Head bunt. Kick. Going for my cross move. My cross going for the tag. Gets the Redeemer again. The Redeemer is fresh. And he can't stop. The Redeemer is... Oh! My cross is still legal, barely. In this, and now he needs to get out of the ring. Bulldog by the Redeemer, Damien Zadok. And the Redeemer continues to go for that arm. Ah! Ah! Get him over. This could do it. This could do it. <laughs> Damien Zadok's a little frustrated. He was hoping Dead Dude would tap out on that, but didn't. So he's going to try something different. Dead Dude gets up again. Double team. And Mike Cross is in there illegally. He needs to get out of that ring. Not one, two. Did you barely getting out? Motherfucker. Get them up. Oh. One, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here's your winner. The team of. Suicide, Mike Cross, and the Redeemer, Damien Zadok! <laughs> this is just despicable right here. I mean, freaking throwing him out for good measure, knocking both guys out, and they cheated to get this win. There's no way that they would have won if they didn't cheat. But they're the winners of the AWS versus RHW Tag Team Special Match. And they look like they're in love. <laughs>